I've I'm got to so say, sad. this is something that you wanted to learn how I to did. do on Ready, Steady, Cook. I, I Tell everybody what you, what, what you uh, actually said. I wanted to learn how to use the blowtorch. I don't know if I'm doing yeah, it yet. Yeah, <laughs> Hold it quite close. Oh, quite Can close. Can you see that? Yeah. And then... When do you know it's, it's, when it's, it's brown? It's, it's, it's going to there. It's going to brown right before your eyes. I'll move that around now. Oh, OK. And, and then what, what, uh, what we actually need now, you see, when you get to that stage, you do another coating, so you get a really, and hold we'll it there, it again. and you get a lovely crispy coat on it. You know what I mean? Because when you bite into it, you get a really lovely crunch. Hold it till it's nice and brown. See how that one's crispy yeah. on the outside? Fish Jane, yes, where's, yeah. the, where's the fish gone? The little bit of fish that I had marinating, and I can't find it's... it anywhere. Oh, dear. It oh. Where's it gone, Jane? Ahead Can you see it? Am I... Oh, Is Jane. Give her a round of applause. I'm glad she's got a header. Jane, we're going to need to put a little bit of sugar in that vanilla cream that you've made. Maybe you want to tell Ainsley how you did that vanilla cream for me. This mm -hmm. one has got some um, cream and yogurt. OK, that. yeah, you sprinkle a little sugar into that and I'll finish that off for you there. Uh, but where is the sugar? Uh, just, well, you can use a bit of icing oh, sugar, okay. actually. Yeah, not uh, well, yeah, icing sugar or a little bit of caster. Icing sugar means it's not so grainy. That's so you don't, you, you don't get those, yeah, those little bits. So if you look back on your career, Jane, would you do anything differently? Um... No, I mean, we've, you know, we've had difficult periods, you know, and it's been a lot of hard work, mm. but I think the rewards outbalance all of that. You sure, know, sure. We're so lucky to have this opportunity now to still be doing it, I you know, know it's something incredible. that we love, you know, and it becomes your job and your work. And what was it like having all that pressure? Because at one point the whole nation thought that you and Chris were romantically involved, because when you danced, you danced so beautifully together, almost as one. Was that um, ever, an, ever a pressure? Yeah, we found it, at first we found it kind of odd that people were interested in our personal lives mm. and not just the skating, but then as, you know, we got older and more mature, obviously that's going to happen. But, um, yeah, I mean, we just used to tease the press and they say, when you get married, we said, oh, not this year. <laughs> <laughs> and at, all the, at the same time, you all have partners, you're doing your own yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. Lovely. <laughs> all right, Les, is that all right? There's only about four or five there that are done, lovely. but uh, some of them need a little bit more icing sugar on them, but the, the blowtorch needs a bit more gas in, I think, my love. OK, lovely. Jane, just get a bit more of that in there. Did you put some sugar in there for I us? I put icing sugar Brilliant. in. Brilliant. Taste okay. it to make sure it's, it's sweet enough. Sweet. There we are. Have a little bit of a taste of that. Be sweeter. A bit sweeter. Okay, okay, let's get some icing sugar in there. Okay, you've got two two minutes to go. Shut your head, you lot. There you go. All right, two minutes. There we go. Sorry, Jane. You tell him, Jane. There you go, my love. There that we are. Really give that a bit of that, an invigoration. Oh! Oh, there we are. Thank you. Hey? Thanks, mm. thanks. You don't need a food process with me around, no, do I you? No, I don't. OK, look at this fish, guys. Look at the vegetables. Look at the carrots. And anything special with those sesame seeds, oh, Les? Olive oil, um, sesame seeds, orange and honey, OK? OK. Did you bring over your oranges? Oh, sorry. What's that tray hot? Be careful, my love. Be careful, we darling. Are. OK. okay. We might need a bit of kitchen paper. Here we are, Les. Only Let's... just to wipe the edge. OK, my love. Let's just get that there. All right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm no, actually going to leave our on. chefs to get on with it, ladies and gentlemen. You know it's that time, don't you? One minute to go. Let's see how it all ends up on the plate. Do you prefer paper? Yeah. Coming together, yeah? Coming together. OK, here we go. 50 seconds. Saved it. Wow. Right, okay, right, okay. You got the screen? From the herd. Okay, 40 seconds, guys. That'd be great. Up, up, down this end, please. Right, and then that's brilliant. Put that in there. I'll get this out of the way. Watch out very, very hot. Out of the way. Cut the chicken. Uh, less than half a minute now. Oh, Jane, where does it go? Right. Now, Chris, I want you to get Early. 20 Wait. seconds. I wonder if they're going to get this out on time. Everyone seems to be under a little bit of pressure. Audience, let's count them down, shall we? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go! Cookie! Okay, what's on the menu today for Torval and Dean? I'm about to tell you. In the green kitchen, Leslie and Jane have been busy preparing potato and white wine ragu. We also have roasted asparagus and carrots with orange sugar and sesame. And finally, Jane Torval's vanilla cream with toasted glazed oranges. And in the red kitchen, James and Chris have been busy preparing vanilla rice pudding. And finally, 
Christine's pineapple, maple and pecan tart with whipped cream. OK, let's see what it tastes like. Are you ready for this? Yes. Please, it's your. Uh, you have Wait. to pre prepare yourself to dine. It really looks very, very scrumptious. Tell us what you did with this uh, lovely dish. Okay, here, so what we did was we parboiled the potatoes and got the mushroom ragu going with lots of butter and garlic. Cook the fish very, very simply in some lemon butter and black pepper and just set it on top of the mm. ragu. And what do you think of these in here? These is just simply carrots which have been roasted in a little bit of sugar and butter and olive oil. The asparagus was added towards the end and finally the sesame seeds go on at the end, otherwise they're burned Lovely. and just toast Could them. Could we tempt you with this then? Mm. Yes, You're going to have, have a little bit of that? Go on then, I'll hold that for you. Just I do like Get a little bit with um, mm. the orange Sushi. segment and the coriander. So we've just got marinated fish here. It's nice to do it with lemon sole. Cut it nice mm. and thin. Oh. Loads of lime, mm. lemon, black pepper um, and some coriander and some orange. And finally, your pudding here. Your pudding. That Get is in so there. delicate and fresh tasting. And it's clean. Really, yeah. Mm. Straight in there. This is the orange and uh, this is your own little personal dessert here, isn't it? Eh? So this is just wh a lightly whipped cream, Greek yoghurt, vanilla seeds mm. and then the toasted oranges. It's just the right amount of sweetness in it yeah. as well. I don't like anything too sweet. So. You saw how I shaked it, didn't you? That, That's it was, you I think it was down that. to you, yeah. yeah no, it was both of us. We shook it together, didn't we, We Jake? did shake it together, yeah. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen, Leslie and Jay! Cutlery, mate. Where shall we start? There's so much going well, on. Here. Let's go for the chicken. Mm -hmm. um, I cook the chicken with a bit of crushed garlic, three quarters mm. of the way through. Then we mm -hmm. finished it with some honey. Uh, Chris chopped me some chilli, and then you just baste it around and create some wonderful sticky glaze mm. on some beans that have been sautéed down with um, a touch of onion and a touch of salt. That's it, because you get the sweetness as well oh, from the chicken. Chilli coming through there. It's fantastic. Yeah. yeah. It's, I, I've, I've watched magic today. Because mm. to me, this is all magic. It's like oh. what you guys do. People are pretty. Do you know what I mean? If you're really good at something, then you can understand when someone. Practicing their art, and both Leslie and uh, James has just done that today magnificently. With, with the rest of um, with the rest of the beans, we chopped them up and we toasted off the spices Watch with the itself. onion that you chopped for me, the, yep. which is your first mm. job. Very important to cook your spices out. Mm. Adds a wonderful flavour, and, sure. and by doing that, mm. by adding the green beans, um, a touch of cream to it as well, cook down the cauliflower as well, some almonds, traditional korma curry, nothing sure. too too over the top spicy. Okay. Uh, fragrant rice, obviously Good with the chili in. We've got some vanilla rice pudding as well. The rest of the rice, and then go for this Good one. This is um, the tart with <laughs> the pastry. Oh, I know my this, son. In there. I've been waiting to try this one. Pecans, here you go. Uh, pecans, some brown sugar, and a bit of butter. First, we'll get a little bit of coloration. Mm. Hit it with maple syrup over with a pastry lid. Bake it for ten minutes, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, and uh, flip it out on a bit of whipped cream to finish. Can't go wrong. That makes you feel a bit at home in America, that one, doesn't it? Absolutely. The, I mean, just the the texture and the taste, like Jane said, not too sweet, but just just the right amount of citrus coming through and the and the sweetness together. It's fantastic. Oh, cool. Lovely, lovely. The boys, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, <laughs> James and Chris. <laughs> Ooh, oh, this could be a difficult one. Is it going to be a girl day with lovely Leslie and uh, Jane over there? Or is it going to be a boys day with James and Chris? Once again, down to our studio audience. Green for the girls, red for the boys. Please pick up your keypads, because I'd like you all to vote now. OK, let's see uh, what's impressed you here. We've got some succulent chicken, lovely desserts. But the other side, we've got soul, fish, something the nation is getting to love more and more and more. What have you decided on? Well, the screens are beginning to fill up now. OK, who's won today's 20-minute challenge? Sort this out and tell us. As you can see, it's a red chicken Well done to you there, my man. And there's your ready to cook uh, winner's plate. Oh, James, fantastic. Yeah, well done to both of you. And we'd also like to make a donation towards your favourite charity, Chris. Do you have one? Yeah, we'd like to donate it to the uh, Royal London. London Society for the Blind. Mm. Uh, we've been involved with them for quite a while now. So. Nice. Lovely. Well done. Oh, well done to you, Very nice indeed. Oh, darling, darling. Hey. When he's the other side of the world in America, you're thinking, oh, and he's drinking all that tea that don't taste like tea, you can have your proper oh, tea <laughs> in the Ready Steady Cook mug! Yay! Thank you. Great to see you. Good luck with dancing tonight. Thank you. Well done, oh, thank you very much indeed. OK, you know what's going to happen now, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, more.